and my name is Danny Farmer. Welcome back to our channel and I, I've been running field trials and, and had some success for 40 years plus. But let me tell you where I started. I was a Louisiana duck hunter and I hunted on the, I hunted with dogs that were well trained and I can say that all this may sound complicated but if I were training a dog to go hunting I would train him exactly the same way. I would not, this is how I would train my dog. I would teach him, I would condition him so I, I could control his response, you could control him around the blind, he would handle. And every dog that we've trained, that we've sold to duck hunters, they rave about them. And they've all been trained the same way for 40 years. We've sold all these dogs uh, that would be more or less not quite what we're looking for, but they still have to be trained in the duck blind. In other words, they're not familiar with, with 200 decoys, they're not familiar with getting in the pit, they're not familiar with five guns coming out of the hole shooting. So you do have to, you know, you have to spend a time there where you, where you work with this dog. And you're going to get out of him what you put in. And so uh, if, you're going to, if you're going to train one this way, then you also got to uh, do some things for duck hunting. But most of them make wonderful duck dogs. We would say the same thing for upland hunting or pheasant hunting. One thing I would think would be very important, you want control. You want him to, to bring the bird back and deliver the hand, and, and I think all these tools will help you to get those things. And then directed to people who aren't as familiar with this stuff as, as a lot of hunt test guys and stuff are, just the guy who got his first collar and he's going out to train his dog. It's very important that you still go through the basics and the conditioning of stuff. And, and we're gonna show you these things later on. You gotta remember, you can't get angry at the dog if he doesn't understand. So if you get angry and you hit that button, you may lose your dog, he'll bolt. So the conditioning is huge. You gotta get them conditioned where, you, where they understand what you're trying to communicate to them. Just burning a dog with a collar will not work. It'll, it's a wonderful tool, but it's a, and an easy tool to use, but it also can be an awful tool if used wrong. We want you to know that our channel is geared towards training retrievers. And so we're gonna do some field trial stuff, but we're gonna also do some stuff that will help you to, for your hunting dog, for your, uh, your master hunter. We're gonna do things. We're just gonna show you how to train that dog to do the things you want him to do, but it's not necessarily field trial. We, we want it to be for the hunter also. 